Hey, what is up guys? This is Primal Dialga, and today we're just going to be looking at the most recent trailer um, for Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. At the day I'm recording this, it is August 18th, 2017. But anyway, let's jump on into it. So, obviously, you're going to start out with the three starters that you had in Pokemon Sun and Moon. You're going to start out with either Rowlet or Litten or Poplio, so no change there. But the first change that I do see in the trailer is and I don't want to overhype something that might not be accurate, but in the trailer you see your character getting chased around or, or walking around with a rock ruff. So remember how someone data mined uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon and there was actual templates for some Pokemon walking animation that wasn't in any of the battles it was just walking animation um, I don't know this with a hundred percent certainty but there's a possibility that you might be able to walk around with your Pokemon I really have no idea but if indeed you can walk around with your Pokemon, like you could in Heart Gold and Soul Silver, and a little bit in Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum, I definitely wouldn't complain. That was a pretty cool little gimmick that they had. And also in the trailer, uh, it shows a cave with a lot of greenery in it. Um, I can't remember the name of the cave, but I think this is the same one of the first trials that you do in Pokemon Sun and Moon. So, like I said, can't remember the name of it, but it looks like it's coming back. And then it also shows a glimpse of Kahili, Kahili, whatever you want to call her. Um, but she's the flying type Elite Four in Sun and Moon. I don't know what she does in Ultra Sun and Moon, but she's coming back. And then next we have Ryuki and... I don't remember the full significance of him in Sun and Moon. I just remember that after you know you become the champion, he ends up challenging you. Um, but yeah, this male version of Lady Gaga is going to be back in the game. It also, for some reason, his gym, or I guess he's in a gym, it looks kind of like Lieutenant Surge's gym, you know, with all the trash cans. So, I mean, there's that as well. And next you see a Vulpix on a table, and it looks like someone from the Aether Foundation off to the right. So, the Aether Foundation is coming back in Ultra Sun and Moon, which I couldn't imagine them not being in there, but whether they're going to play the same kind of role as they did in the previous games, we'll see. And next we see a character running by what well, looks like a clothing store. I really don't know. I mean, the only thing I could think of that it also looks like would maybe be a circus, but I'm going to go with it as a clothing store. But this next part actually excites me a lot more than the whole rest of the trailer. Um, so it shows a map, or it shows the whole Alola region. And there's a big purple swirly cloud above Pony Island. And I'm pretty sure that's where the Ultra Beasts ended up coming through um, in, at the end of Pokemon Sun and Moon. But also it bears a striking resemblance to that big purple swirly cloud that was above Mount Coronet in Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum. So I don't want to say... Sinnoh is confirmed, but Sinnoh better freaking be confirmed. And then it also shows you that, you know, you can customize your characters like you could in Sun and Moon. Uh, not really anything new there, but I'm glad they're bringing it back. And next, it also tells us something that we should already know, but some people aren't as up to date on... Uh, the Sun and Moon news that pumps out. But uh, yeah, it just shows the Lycanroc Dusk form uh, and it shows the ability, which I made a video, a short little video about that. 
says it can learn Accelerock and Counter. I do not remember what Accelerock does. I need to double check on that. But I don't know, it sounds cool. So maybe it'll be good. And then it also says only certain rock rough will evolve into the dusk form and that more details are coming soon so I don't really know exactly what to what to pull out of that all I can say is we'll just have to wait and see but yeah guys that's about all I've got for you today uh, I just wanted to make a quick breakdown video just in case there was something that you guys had missed uh, also, if there was something that I missed that you want me to touch more on or that you just want to give your opinion about, be sure to leave a comment below and let me know about that. And I will see you guys in the next video.